Before this week, you probably never heard of the name Coney, but now he's found internet stardom with a YouTube video that is rocketing into video viral territory. Pro News 7 social media manager Travis Ruiz is live with more on the local movement inspired by this viral video campaign. Trav? Lisa, Steve, it's spearheaded by the advocacy group called Invisible Children, and it's captured the attention of millions. And now some local groups are coming together to help fight the groups that are blamed for thousands of militias and killings during the last 26 years. Viral doesn't even begin to describe this video. Right now, there are more people on Facebook than there were on the planet 200 years ago. Millions are watching the video about the campaign that's aimed to raise support for the arrest of Joseph Coney. Coney is guilty of brutal war crimes that includes kidnapping thousands of children and using them as soldiers, forced laborers, and such slaves. The video is sparking movements across the globe and even right here at home. Ryan Van Dusen is the youth pastor at the Church of Christ at the Colonies, and he's organizing Cover the Night Amarillo. Our idea is we want to, on the, on the 20th, along with hundreds of other cities in the, in the world, we want to uh, go out that night and hang up posters, stickers, and, and just canvas the city with these Stop Coney posters. And along with the popularity of the video, concerns are also being raised about the administrative costs of invisible children and the amount of money that is actually going to help people. If you want to really be effective, if you want to make a difference, then you need to give to effective organizations. Um, organizations with a high administrative percentage, your dollar is not doing as much as it could be. Kitchen says helping is, of course, better than not helping, but you should research your options. Local or whether it's across seas, if you, if you are going to give to an organization, make sure you know where your dollar is going. As for Amarillo's efforts, they are more dedicated to spreading awareness to the humanitarian crisis in Uganda. That we support the cause completely, that there's all kinds of stuff that follows the organization. Um, but for us, what we want to do is simply raise awareness here in Amarillo. Now, the video, as of just a few seconds ago, had 39 million views on YouTube. To find out more information on the event Cover the Night Amarillo, you can visit our website. That's connectamarillo.com. Lisa and Steve. All right, Travis, thank you very much for that.